Hey guys, it's Rotha Gulm, and welcome back to Faulty Apprentice. We're going around looking for carrots for our bunny guard up in our room, but we're about to do a normal job for this wolf guard. I do want to go through and see if I can get her that carrot, though, because she's been the nicest to me thus far. The wolf has been nice to me, the unicorn's been nice to me, but I seem to interact with the bunny most often, so I'm going to try to go for her first. Uh, so let's do this normal job for the wolf and see what happens. Squirrel. It ran up the tree. Did you see that? Oh, we already did all this stuff. We already was talking about chasing off the squirrel so that she can actually focus on her guard duty. Now we should have enough ability to do it. Uh, all, uh, all, ugh. all right. I knew you were different than normal humans by the way you smell. Go get him, tiger. Uh, you head into the castle wood behind the archery range. At first, chasing away squirrels was kind of a joke, but maybe from being around the wolf guard, you uh, or your own primal instincts awakening. Uh, you begin taking the squirrel hunt very, very seriously. Uh, no more castle. No more apprenticeship. No more job. This is now man versus squirrel. Jesus. Okay, what do I do? Do I have to do anything here? Are the squirrels attacking? Several hours later, you emerge from the castle woods as a champion. Walking up with two cages jam-packed full of squirrels, the wolf guard is marveling at you. By the fang... That's the most squirrels I've ever laid eyes on. You're the greatest. Maybe we should call you Squirrel Hunter. Please don't. Squirrels are probably difficult prey for a human. You deserve a reward. How about a ki Oh, okay. How about a kiss? I've always wanted to kiss a human. Why not? I was hoping for a carrot, but the wolf girl, the wolf girl, ugh, the wolf guard pounces on you and moves her face closer to yours or close to yours. You close your eyes and pucker your lips to meet hers. All of a sudden, you feel a sloppy wet tongue lick your nose. I should have seen that coming. You know, I was thinking to myself, I'm like, she's got really sharp teeth, but if she kisses me, like, she probably won't use her teeth or anything like that, so it should be like a normal kiss. But she is a wolf, so she kissed my, so she licked my nose, rather. Makes total sense. Huh, you're pretty, you're, you taste pretty yummy. Oh god, don't eat me. Huh, you're a good kisser, maybe we should bird. Oh great, I'm gonna have to chase off the birds now. Oh boy, the wolf guard jump, runs off, jumping into the air, trying to poke at a pigeon with her lance. 12 foot lance too from what I understand if she reaches with it probably gets up to a good you know 16 17 feet it appears squirrels weren't the only thing distracting her from guard duty I wonder what I'm gonna do with all these squirrels now oh I actually have a basket of squirrels or cage squirrels time two uh, your courage has increased yay so I should be able to talk to the instructors more now um, where to now forest edge lower courtyard damn it uh, lookout point see if anyone's there nope still nothing North Yard. Who's it? Nope, I did that. That's where the uh, the ram was. Prison. Goth chick. Never more life is a bore. Oh, I didn't want to. Perpetration suck. Now having to wake up early for training Mondays through Fridays. I wish the sword instructor would respect my creative hours. How am I supposed to stay up late expressing myself? Should be one word. If I have to wake up early the next day. Dark words should be written in the dark hours. See? That sounded wicked, huh? I told you. I told you I would was good at poetry uh either a comma here and there a period or just remove one of those uh i'm sorry i don't mean to be critical i it's it's a habit that i developed i always said that every year i went to school i had two english teachers i had my teacher and i had my mother so i i can't help it i, I apologize i don't want you guys to think that i'm like trying to to put down the product that you're working on it's literally just the way my mind works uh, hail apprentice. All right, the orc. Uh, there's a yellow cat that fishes from the stream by the bridge. It's very cute for some reason. It makes me happy when I see her. Kind of reminds me of the wizard's assistant. That's because it is her. She has straw-colored hair, just like the cat. I've only seen her around the castle once or twice, though. Her and her wizard usually stick to themselves in the mage tower. Don't ask me to go up there, though. It's not that the magician scares me. It's just that I'm not very fond of heights, you see. Oh. All right, normal job. What do you got for me? Standard issue toothbrush for castle guards. Oh, yeah, that's right. We can do this now. I forget what we needed. We needed some stat we didn't have before. Oh, look at that. That's a fancy-looking toothbrush. Looks like he just pieced it together from other stuff, too. With a broom, chair leg, and a few hours of effort. Oh, broom and chair leg. Okay, and that's the rest of the broom. Uh, you can start a large toothbrush. Buy my axe. Look at that. You don't have an axe. Uh, that is some fine craftsmanship, that is. With this large toothbrush, my tusk will sparkle brighter than the unicorn guard's hair. I don't know about that. Uh, I wish I had a way to reward your efforts. You gonna kiss me too? The orc blushes and stalls for a moment before continuing. 
Here, the bunny guard once told me human males like this. It's a carrot, isn't it? The orc guard tentatively moves closer to you, quickly kissing you on the cheek. Oh, okay. Anyway, I should get back to reinforcing the west gate. Now that I don't have to worry about my tusks looking unattractive, I can focus on battle preparations. Thanks again, Rock. You are a good man. Aw. Courage has increased. Welcome Yay. Welcome back. Oh, good uh, you look exhausted. I, those I didn't do any instruction today. Ah, oh, I didn't do my sword instruction today. Damn it. Oh, well, I'll go back tomorrow. Maybe. Uh, best to get some rest, but if you need anything, bye I'll be right bye outside. Now. Uh, how are my stats doing? All right. Wow, my, my courage is going up pretty quickly, and it looks like I've actually... I don't know if these lines are supposed to signify anything. Like, because you got your first one here, and then you have, like, one, two, and then the final one. So maybe as you get to these, it lets you unlock other stuff. So I feel like I should almost build my courage up before I worry about anything else. The sword instructor. So I only have to worry about my relationships with the instructors, I guess. Well, all right. Can I uh, nothing else to equip, rather. Let's talk to the bunny guard before we go to bed. Some of the guys are saying Durandal left because he was afraid. Others are saying he left for that wet tunic contest, which I think he actually did say he was going to, so that makes sense. I'm not sure what to think, though. Wizards are so strange to begin with. Who knows why they do what they do? At least he left us with a hero, Teehee. If Voltez was truly returned, we'll all need the hero Go we can get. Go get him! Bye oh, we'll need now. all the hero we can get, rather. All right. Moving on to the next day, and we've got to save first thing in the morning. Day four coming up now. Day four. Huzzah. Bunny instructor. Good morning. Rise and shine, Rock. Have you ever used ah, the pen and scroll at the bottom right corner? Yes, I have numerous times. I know we're supposed to be working hard to prepare for war and all, but it's a good idea to record your progress once in a while. <laughs> it might save you one day. Hee <laughs> hee. And it did. Just, well, it would have the first time I tried to play this game, but all right, now I'll let you get on Go your way. Go get him. Speaking of which, save... Saving again. Excellent. Okay. Don't want to go to sleep. Um, let's you know, let's talk to the bunny guard. See if she's got hey a mission there, for me. Sugar plum. Um, she's oh she needs carrots, but she needs them from the guard. So I bye don't bye do anything with her. Let's leave the room. Good work, soldier. Oh, the first guard. I love how it's not human guards. First guard. I see you've been training and doing jobs mm -hmm. around the castle. That's more than I can say about the wizard. No matter, I have use of you. The alchemist. Oh, the alchemist finally is supposed to be uh, producing healing potions. Only she keeps giving excuses on That's why she can't. Eh? Go to the Alchemist Tower and get her back on track with war preparations by Friday afternoon. And don't come back with some lame prank excuse like tentacles in your hair or you were turned into a sheep. I've heard it all before, so don't bother. Now, are those the lame excuses that the Alchemist has used, or is that was what has resulted from alchemy? Very Any well. questions? Good. Move, Move on out, soldier. Uh, you know what? Let's, uh, I trust everything is everything in order. Everything is in order, Prentice? Yeah, let's talk to her Very first. Very well. Suppose you've heard the other guys talking about the recent incident with the sword instructor. Unacceptable. No? Well, stop talking about it and quit spreading rumors. Mm. First, you must know there was a mishap in communication. Our enemy set a trap for us and we failed to see it in time. Something we will not let happen again. There, now you have it. Get back on. Get back to duty. You're a soldier of the Star's Reach now. That's Remember. That's an order. Stay Can't out do the of trouble. Job? Now, which one are you? A doll guard. That's interesting. Huh. Anyway, okay. The guard opens the scroll pad and begins writing with a coal pen. After a moment, she holds it up to you. Hey, new person. Welcome to the castle. Smiley face. All right, so she doesn't have the ability to speak. Dare I talk to the commander? I dare. Why not? Apprentice. Yeah, ooh, I'm going to need a lot of whatever that stat is. Commander gives you a long, slow look over from head to toe and seems to wait a moment for you to say something. Apprentice. I trust your training is going well. Yes, well ma'am. Well done. Very good, I must Rock. Consider. When you have trained enough, I would like. Uh, would you like to tend to the alchemist for me? We need to start producing healing potions as soon as possible. Wow, she is actually nicer than the first guard. I do not have time for such oh. pleasantries. Oh, I thought I was supposed to touch them in like bio pages. What do you think you're doing, apprentice? Oh, okay. Oh well. So then, I should be able to touch the doll and the, the first guard. Oh no, it's not letting me do that to her. Just let me do the commander for I some reason. I trust everything is in order. Yes. 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 I had to. Sorry, I couldn't Stay resist. Out of <laughs> All right. Alchemist Tower. Where are there you are. And we have a mission there too. Oh. You're the alchemist. Um I think we'll find out what happened to you in just a moment. 
Marine guard. Okay, so octopus, squid, and I get it, marine life. Yeah, don't sneak up on me like that. Talk. The guard leans in and speaks in a half whisper, she, like she doesn't want to be overheard. Keep your guard up and don't touch anything. One day I was thirsty, so the alchemist offered me a drink. Biggest mistake ever. That's probably what happened to you. Next thing you know, my hair has turned into this, and I have a new taste for seafood. Oh, my hair turned into tentacles excuse. So that is the legitimate excuse. All right, let's talk to her first. Wait, I already talked to her. God damn it. All right, uh, go away, and let's talk to the alchemist What now. can we do for you? Yes, yes, come in. We heard you joined the ranks of soldiers and have been waiting for a chance to experiment on you. Ex really? Experiment on me, huh? I was hoping you'd say with me. No, wait. Exam- wait, no, examine you. That- I like that better. Uh, blast it, meet you. Hee <laughs> hee. Jesus Christ. <laughs> She's gonna kill me, isn't she? Uh, we've been looking forward to meeting you. I feel like the we that she's talking about, like, is, like, the two beings that she has going on here. It's not like, oh, it's the, you know, the people in the castle, and I don't think she's pulling off the royal we. I think she's actually got, like, a multiple personality thing going on. <laughs> uh, the alchemist takes one of your arms. Oh, yes. I'm sorry, I had to listen to her just making her little, her inspection no noises. The alchemist takes one of your arms, and she begins systematically squeezing the muscles and testing the joints. If dolls were alive, you imagine how... You imagine this is how they would what feel. What can we do for you? All right, so let's talk. She's wearing her underwear on the outside, too. Huh. She's a little backwards and inside out, I guess. Urgent jobs, huh? Let's talk first. Do you ever get so excited for work you forget to put on your pants in the morning? No. Uh, would that... Would that we had time to change, but these exciting... But these are exciting times. Imagine what we would discover if Durandal gave us access to the Mana Stone. Unlimited magical energy, they say. Exciting stuff. <laughs> and there's the other personality. All right. Or unlimited power. Oh, shut up. Oh, pipe down. Yep, so there are two sides to her. Excellent. It's because of talk like that that we're not permitted access to the stone. Not only that, I was having a conversation with the wizard's new apprentice, and you rudely interrupted. Now, what were we talking about what again? What can we do for you? Okay, I gotta start Our raising tools my. Oh, wait, she... open. What can we do for you? I, mean, I guess I can't take the job, even though it doesn't think it'll let me. Troubles and tentacles, speedy spiders, frugal flowers. Huh, blue, green, or what yellow? Can we do what do I you? Know, I gotta go back to my room and see what I have. Welcome back. How you doing? Uh, stats. Blue, green, and yellow. They're all at level two. Oh, so red is my courage. Yeah, okay. I'm going to have to, like, write these down or something just so I can remember what each one is. Because, personally, I would put, like, car like red red should, would be strength. Deck, I don't even know. Like, uh, I don't know. Color, it's not a big deal. Let's go back to the alchemist. We can pretty much do any one of them, What can we do for you? Um, you know what? Let's do the Troublesome Tentacles one. That was strength-based. You don't have enough strength to take on this job. So I don't, probably don't have... Oh, I need... Oh, I get it. So I need... Four, well, four courage to talk to her, I guess. But then I need other, whatever. What can we do to right, So I can't help her just yet. But I gotta get other other stats up if I'm going to. Ah, the only other problem too is I haven't gotten any carrots for the bunny. Huh. Well, let's go to the north yard and uh, well, let's talk Yo. in the train. Yeah, what's up, Rock? Is that so? You knew the commander was put in charge of this castle when she was only ten ten years old. Jesus. Back when I was that age, I was a simple farm girl like you. I'm not a girl. <laughs> well, you're not a girl, of course, but you get what I mean. All right, so at least she like, was, you know, being polite about it. Not polite, but, you know, uh, lighthearted about it. My father and I were in town when the Goblin Raiders attacked. We were completely and utterly helpless. Just when I thought it was over, I saw yeah. her. A girl just like me, but unafraid. She stood atop the village wall, wearing shiny armor and wielding a gigantic blue sword. <laughs> it was the coolest thing I've ever seen. Yeah. Right then, right then I knew I didn't want to be a scared farm girl anymore. I wanted to be like the commander. I want to protect I want people. To, well, there you go. I want to protect uh, people. Jeez, there I go yakking away about my life story. Sorry to bore you. Uh, I think that you're... That's good you want to protect people. Yeah, that story was lame. No, I'm not going to say that. <laughs> All right. Oh, thank gods. I was starting to feel a little embarrassed. <sighs> Haven't really told that story to anyone. Not sure even... Uh, I, Not sure why I even told yeah. that... Uh, not even, whatever. She's not sure why she told that to me. Uh, I guess seeing you brings back memories of home. Oh, your relationship with the sword instructor has increased. Yay. Uh, let's talk is more again. So? Well, since you're so quiet, I'll tell you a bit about myself. 
I'm the sort of instructor in times of preparation like now, but my official rank is captain. However, until you've completed your training, it's proper to address me as instructor. Yo! Why don't you help me gather the equipment for the day? We keep training swords uh, by where those guards are hanging out. Oh, we keep the training swords by where those guards are hanging out. If you grab the swords, I'll grab the shields. If you grab the swords, I'll grab the shields. Huh. Okay, I can help. <laughs> all Great. right. I wish all the soldiers were as eager to help as you. Why don't you get a head start? I'll catch up. As you collect swords from the barracks and bring them out to the yard, you overhear a couple of guards talking. Shadow guard? That's new. Um, I hear the sword instructor made a huge mistake and almost got a lot of our soldiers killed. Oh, this is what they were talking about, where, you know, to stop spreading rumors and stuff. And a shady guard, more like almost getting herself killed. The royal commander had to go out in the field and save her. Do you think Vault has, has really returned and joined forces with the Goblin King? Of course not. That was probably just some lame attempt to cover up the sword instructor's incompetence. Ha, huh, you're right, and now with that scar on her head, she's as ugly as she is stupid. <laughs> at any moment, the sword instructor could walk in and hear the guards laughing at her. What will you do? I'll confront them. She's my friend. I like the sword instructor. Uh, without thinking, you confront the guards with your best attempt at a stern commanding voice. Hey, guard, shut your damn mouth. That's no way to speak about your captain. Huh? Who the hell are you? Wait, I know you. That's the stupid wizard's new apprentice. Ah, yes, the special boy. Everyone keeps calling me special. I don't like it. You think we're afraid of a little go uh, goblin puke like you? Yeah, bring it on. It was at that moment you... <laughs> it was at that moment he realized he done goofed. It was at that moment you realized you have been holding a training sword and shield this whole time. The guards draw their weapons and slowly begin to surround you. They must have thought you, uh, you were challenging them to a fight. Yeah, defend myself. Why not? Even if I got my ass kicked, your strength was not high enough to defend the guard's attack. Oh, I got smashied many times, it sounds like. Heh <laughs> that's what happens. That's what that's what will happens, butt kissers around here. That's a typo. Yeah. After dealing after dealing you sound after dealing you a sound beating, the guards skulk off cackling. Yo! Hey, what's taking you so uh. long? By the saints, what happened to you? The sword instructor grabs you by the forearm like a dwarvish handshake and pulls you up from the ground. <laughs> At least now we know you can take a beating. Well, that's good. So my stamina and my endurance are good. Uh, you're all right, though, aren't you? Do I dare talk to her again? Eh, let's train with her. All right. Was wondering if you were going to be training today. Uh, I am free right now if you want to go a couple rounds. Would you like to begin training? Yes, I would. <laughs> all right. I hoped you would say that. We left off with moving uh, the strike zone, right? Got yes. it. Let's pick back up from there. I'll switch up the strike zone location, and you try to land three solid attacks. All right. All right, let's do this. Sword up. Yep. One, two, nope. Two, two, stop it. Uh, 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 Jesus. I swear to God, I'm clicking them. Well, that was three. Oh, and there goes the game again. Damn it. It's always with the sword instructor, too, it seems. Oh, well. I mean, oh, I did. Did I save at the start of this day? Did I? Um, I don't know. It's not even letting me look. Um, load. All right, now I'll let you get on your way. Crap, I think I was, I'm day four right now, I think. Well, I mean, the, uh, again, I know this is always meant to happen. It's it's going to happen no matter what. Um, So, unfortunately, you know what? I'm not going to end this episode just yet. I, I want to get a, a solid half hour in. So, I'm going to load the game from my last point. It, it's going to make it very hard, it seems, to get myself to where I want to be. But, actually, what day am I on? Oh, I'm still on day four, okay. So, I'm glad I did save. All right, well, all right, I gotta go through Good all that work, stuff with the fighter soldier. again, so I'll be back in a moment. Mm -hmm. Oh, I gotta go through all this stuff, though. That's all right, yeah, I'm gonna, fast I'm gonna go through all the stuff I did Pretty again, well. and then once I have the opportunity, I'm gonna save uh, where I was before. All right, I am now back to where I was before the game glitched out. Let me try talking to her Is one more time. Is that so? Oh, uh, nope, this is the same thing. Yo. Tell me about herself. All right, gotta skip all this. Nope, not gonna help now. All right, Till next bye. time, apprentice. Uh, the alchemist still has stuff for me, and I did I did save this time, so I should be all set. Um, you know what? Let's try the mage tower. See if she'll talk to me now. <laughs> yeah, the boy. Oh, damn it. Okay. Torn piece of paper falls to the ground in front of you. Pick it up again. 
Go over the paper and find some sort of journal entry. Dear diary, Durandal wasn't in the mage tower this morning, so I went to look out to look for him. When I asked the orc guard, she said he left the castle without saying why. I thought that was really weird. Why would he just leave all of a sudden? Anyway, I don't know what to do, so I went down to the river to catch breakfast. Then the strangest thing happened. Goblins attacked the west gate. There weren't, they weren't like the goblins that live under the bridge either. They had pointy weapons and shiny, uh, spiky armor. It was so scary. Just when I thought they were going to get me, a human boy appeared. He looked kind of scruffy, but maybe that's just how all boys are. I thought he... The rest of the paper is torn away, so you're unable to continue reading. Your relationship with the mage instructor has increased. Really? I didn't even do anything. All right, then. Um, huh, where to now? Let's go to the archery range, see if we can piss off the uh, the archery hmm. instructor. Well, if it isn't Durandal's special boy, want? let's talk to her. <laughs> that old wizard Durandal is nothing but mischief, I say. Once I caught him rummaging through my undergarment drawer and reported to the commander. He told me he was adding protective enchantments or something stupid like that. And get this, he actu she actually believed him. <gasps> I don't know why the commander has so much respect for that old uh, car jerk. Uh, uh, I bet you're just like him. All men are. We can't all be bad. I thought he was cool. Yeah, we can't all be bad. Hmm. The archery instructor gives you a quick look over, like a dwarf uninterested in a right. jewel. Uh, right. Well, not like I care anyways. Yeah, you're definitely uh, Sundere. Um, your relationship... Or ya Yandere, Sundere? I don't remember which one it is. I think it's Sundere. Um, your relationship with the archery instructor what has increased. What do you want? Let's talk to her again. Maybe if you're not so annoying... I can't, like, talk right now. There's stuff I've got, got to, like, do. What do you want? Uh, you know what? At the risk of this glitching up again, let's save here, and let's do some training with her. <laughs> Probably not. How are you supposed to train archery if you don't have your bow what and arrow you equipped? Want? God <laughs> damn it. All right. You know what? North Yard. Nope. Talked to those already. Archery range. We were just there. Westgate. The Westgate was attacked, right? Hey, apprentice. Let's talk to her. There's a yellow cat that fishes in the stream, yada yada, whatever. All right. You know what? She's got, um... Number two, green for a normal job. That's going to lodge toothbrush. You're a good man now. I can smile like a pri proud orc. All right, we don't have to worry about that because we already did the job for her. Uh, forest. No one else really has a job for me. Uh, all right, you know what? I'm going to risk it. I'm, I'm going to, against my better judgment, because I already have my sword and board equipped, I'm going to try no. training with the sword instructor again. All right. See if this will work this time. <laughs> All right, got All it. All right, three strikes and hitting the strike All zone. Right. Got it. Sword up. All right, so All I don't have to right. click wildly, apparently, because that's what I was doing before, and I think that's what was screwing things up. Woo, look at you go. Is that so? Are you sure you've never had sword training before? Yeah, I'm actually, I'm sure that I have, because this is the second time I've trained with you. <laughs> All uh, right. You're off to a great start today. Let's keep going. How about we go for five hits? Think you can do that? All yeah, right. let's go. All right, let's do this. Sword Ready. up. Ooh. See, I just have to like be patient and click when All I need to. Right. Woo. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. Uh-oh. Uh, it glitched in the middle of the conversation. Well, that's new. Sword instructor, you, uh... I want to be friends with you really badly, and you're just not letting me do it. All right, let's uh, let's load up the game here, if we can. Uh, load, and there we go. All right, well, then I'm gonna have to figure something else out to do. Let's, you know, let's uh, let's talk Welcome to some back. of the guards again. Uh, talk to the bunny guard. Hey there, sugar plum. Um, do you hear I that? Reckon. See the bunny guard's ears perk and angle toward oh. the window. I swear I can hear whispers coming from outside, like a snake slithering oh, through haystacks. Goblins. Uh, you really don't hear it now. Whatever it is makes the fur on the back of my neck mm. stick up. I reckon it I can't be reckon. good. You be careful now, Prentice. Go you get him. All right, so she's three on green. Bye bye right. now. So stats. Let's look at stats. Dexterity. I need to increase it one more. So I get. So let me let me put on my archery equipment, and I will go and train as an archer to increase that. No, I don't want to go to sleep. It's still a new day. Uh, not yet. Okay. Leave the room. Go to the archery range. Save the game because we need to continuously save. Hmm. And let's see if want? we can get some trading in. Right. Aren't the other instructors you can be bothering right now? Jesus, she hates me. Anyway, I guess I have some time for you. I mean, 
I mean, time to train you. Oh, maybe she likes me after all. <laughs> you know what I mean. <gasps> uh, you're already annoying me. Let's get this over with. I love how I'm annoying her, but I haven't even said a single word this whole time. Training with the archery instructor will increase your dexterity. Let's start <laughs> training then. Since you didn't completely screw up the basic training, I guess you're ready to continue. Remember how we did single commands last time? Right. Well, now we're going to move on to double commands. This means you need to remember more than one command at a time. Oh, it's like Simon says. No problem. So if I say left, right, shoot the left target, then <laughs> shoot the right target. Think you can handle that, farm boy? I got <laughs> it. Ha, huh, we'll see about that. Right. Just do what I tell you and don't shoot anyone. Well, hopefully no one stands in my way. Target order is up, down. Fire when ready. Up, down. Your target order is right, left. Fire when ready. Right, left. Target order, up, left. Fire, up, left. <gasps> nice and easy. You already completed the second level of archery training. I mean... I mean, so what if you've already finished? Don't get full of yourself because you're prog progressing faster than the other soldiers. <gasps> you're still just a scruffy farm boy that has no business being here. With those final words, the archery instructor storms off the range. Maybe if you come back tomorrow, she will have calmed down enough to continue your training. Well, the archery instructor seems to be the only uh, like training that I can actually do that doesn't glitch out on me, so I think I might just have to keep on going with this. Your dexterity has increased. Oh, she left the range. Okay. So let's leave here. Go back to my room. Welcome back. Check my stats first, because it should be three. Yes, it is. Okay. So let us save. And I see the little thing right here. Talk to the bunny guards. So she, yeah, hey she there, should have a mission for plum. me. <laughs> Gathering job. I know we are in a war. Yep, yeah, the carrots and everything. Wahoo! Oh, I thought I was already kind of doing this by going around talking to the guards. But it, it influenced me to actually go around and talk to the guards, so I guess it kind of worked out all in the end. Uh, do you think you can ask around the guards for an extra carrot? Gathering jobs require key items. Yes. My knight in shining armor. I'll save you a thank you kiss for when you come back now. Go here. get him. Uh, hey there, sugar plum. I, oh, and look at that carrot. Yeah. Oh, now I got it. Okay. Bye now. now I can go around and talk to the guards. Hopefully. Uh, let's start at the forest edge and we'll work our way. Oh, there's. Hmm. there's she's here, huh? Well, Vindra, what do this you is doll's special boy. She can't train me here, I don't think. Maybe if you're not so I can't, like, annoying, talk right now. There's stuff like, do I gotta do. <laughs> well, I'll train with her later. Right now, I'm, off, I'm looking for a carrot. The hidden forest is a mysterious and wonderful place. The wood elves moves fast. sound doesn't, yeah, yeah, dozen things. Animals, archery instructor, hidden forest, no dice there. Okay, Westgate. Maybe the orc has something. Uh... If I had a copper for every time the alchemy instructor made me open the west gate for her, I could have a copper axe forged. Now, I don't mind doing me job at all. I don't, if, I don't know if that was supposed to be me or my, but anyway. But every time I ask where she's off to or when she's expecting to be back, she says it's no business of mine. It's Oh, it is. So it is supposed to be. It's me job to ask questions when folks come in and out of Star's Reach, you see. One of, the, one of these days, she'll be... She'll, one of these days, she's going to get me in trouble. If you haven't noticed yet, the first guard isn't the type to accept excuses. Okay, so no carrot from her. We'll just work our way through systematically. Lower courtyard. I trust guard. everything is in order. Everything is in order, apprentice? Yes, it is. I respect that. A strong chain of command is what keeps soldiers in line and functioning properly. That archery instructor is always giving me attitude. <laughs> She'll even mouth off to the commander at times. Unacceptable. Doesn't sound like she understand. Doesn't, doesn't she understand orders or orders? Mm. Letting her personal feelings get the better of her sets a bad example to the other soldiers. When I bring up her insubordination to the commander, she just tells me to be patient with her. If you ask me, no one should be above the rules. So no Stay carrot. Out of trouble. How about you, doll? Guard of the doll. After a moment, she... Hey, new person. Welcome to the castle. Smiley face. Okay, so no carrot from you either. I am not ending this episode until I get me a carrot. Wolf girl. Greetings, traveler. Smell good for a human. Yeah, we've already been there. Oh, you have another normal job for me, huh? Lances we get sold to fantastic. Oh, we have this already. Gotta skip this. I don't want to take her job on just yet because I want to get the, the bunny girl's job done today. North Yard. Oh, the ram girl. Maybe she has the carrot? Or she has another uh, mission for me. Too sleepy to get my rations. The bunny girl can have my carrot. Yay! All right, tell her I said yawn high. <coughs> I have obtained a carrot. Yay. I should bring it back to the bunny guard right away. Does she still have a mission for me, though? Nope, I guess she didn't have one to begin with. She just had the carrot. All right, so let's head up to the room and Welcome give it to the back. bunny girl. Hey there, sugar plum. Here you go. That moment you begin, the moment you begin to reach for the carrot in your bag, you see the bunny guard's ears perk up. Did you find one? Did you find one? Gracious me, sugar, you did it. Yummy, yummy, yummy. The bunny guard grinds down on the carrot with her teeth so quickly it makes a buzzing sound. Wow. 
Very cartoon-esque, like Bugs Bunny. The process reminds you of when you worked at a lumber yard. <laughs> oh, like, like cutting down the logs. Okay. Nothing beats a fresh carrot, if you ask me. That was awfully kind of you for, uh, to do that for little old me. Now close your eyes and I can give oh, you your reward. Oh, don't be shy now. The money guard hear? leads in to give you a kiss on the cheek. <laughs> so far, all I'm getting are kisses on the cheeks and a lick on the nose. Uh, aren't you just the cutest thing? The bunny guard wiggles her nose and smiles one last time before exiting your room. Your courage has increased. Yay. Welcome back. Night. I, I, I'm already back. Oh, good <laughs> You look man. exhausted. I hope the instructors aren't going too hard on you. Best to get some rest, but if you need anything, bye, I'll be right bye outside. Now. Well... So what does that do now for my stats? Dexterity is still at three. Courage is going up very quickly, though. I need to I need to max out my courage so that I can start working for the commander too. It seems to be the thing. Um, but I also need, I think, one more point in dexterity so I can start to do a job for the alchemist. Because if I remember correctly, I have to start working for her by Friday. So I think what I'm going to have to do is next day, on the next day, I'm going to have to train in dexterity, and then I'm going to have to do a job for the alchemist just so I have everything squared away. But that's going to be for another time. I'm going to save this right now and end this episode here. So thank you all very much for watching. If you like what you've seen and heard, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And having said all that, I will see you all on the other side. Take care.